Okay, I'm going to show a video here how to uh, use chroma key and take out some text from a screenshot here. We'll bring up Power Director here. Okay, I'm going to go up here and say new project. I don't want no shadow files. I want to import my screenshot here, my picture. And I want this one. Okay, what I don't like about it, I don't like that offset red lettering. So I'm going to drag it down here to track 2. I'm going to set the duration for 10 seconds there. We'll go up here to my all media content and I'm going to pick a color board because the area back here is uh, Looks like it's mostly black up in there. Okay, and I'm going to change the duration on it to 10. Okay. Now I'm going to go back up here and go to my media content. We've got this set up. Now I'm going to click here on this. And I'm going to click modify. I'm going to enable chroma key, take the eyedropper, and I'm going to go over here to the red, where I got the good shade of red there. I'm going to click that there, and I'm going to click save. Now I've got that saved, but with the different tones of red, there'll still be a little cleanup that might bleed through the different shades, so I'm going to do a snapshot. And I'm going to call this the IM20. I'm going to put it there. Saved it as a PNG. So now I'm going to remove this snapshot from, or this clip from here. And I'm going to go down and I'm going to get my other one. So I just took a snapshot off. See, most of the red's gone, but I'm going to set my duration again on for 10 seconds here done this okay now I'm going to bring her back up I'm going to highlight it modify it again and I want to zoom in and I can see little traces of red up in there and I'm going to enable the chroma key again I'm going to take my eyedropper and I'm going to go over here and pick up some of them shades of red there that it's you can see your eyedropper sort of picking it up there I'm going to do that and I got that so I got that, that saved now just to be able to show you that it's going to look pretty clean is I'm going to add a zoom effect here and since I got it in the bottom clip, and I would normally place it down there, I guess, so I'm going to put it in here. And I got the zoom. Now, for demo purposes, we're going to go over here to uh, produce. And I'm going to choose MPEG 4. And I'm going to go up here and I'm going to put it in my videos. And I'm just going to name this one. D-I-M so I've already named a bunch of them here but I'm going to name it uh, 20 save and I'm just going to leave this stuff set up since this is for this I'm going to produce it which is rendering Okay, I'll just go ahead and go back to there. No. Now I'm going to 
do this and we'll go to my videos the IEM 20 it's here and I'm going to play it and see my red lettering is gone that offset red lettering is gone and it's about the fastest way to do something like it okay so I'm going to close this I'm going to bring up this and I'm going to